Right, guys, I am joined now by the 2015 Miss India UK. That's the current Miss India UK, Miss Nandini Patel. How are you? I'm good, thanks, Nitin. And you? I'm, I'm, no one ever asked me that. I'm feeling good. You're looking great. <laughs> You are the current Miss India UK. Tell me a little bit about how your year's been going so far. You're about halfway through it, right? Yes. So I've recently acted in a South Indian film. I was also an extra in Bollywood movie. And I'm doing, I've got some projects lined up, but I can't talk about them, I'm afraid. So, yeah. You must not understand that this is B for you. We, we do B for you exclusives. <laughs> Miss India UK has always give us B for you exclusives. So. At the moment, they're in the pipeline, so I can't say anything. But oh, yeah. Man. She's been media trained as well. <laughs> That's what they all say. That's it. We know how to say it. <laughs> so, okay, tell me, you know, you're about halfway through your year, which is kind of an interesting point. We're at the launch of the 2016 Miss India UK. Now, you kind of got to be having mixed feelings because, you know, on one hand, you know, you went through this, this kind of process and, and you're halfway through enjoying this year. You know, you've still got so much more to do. You're not quite ready to hand over your crown yet, but the process has already started for the next one. How, how, how does that make you feel? Um, I'm actually excited to meet the contestants. <laughs> I know it sounds weird, but I am. No, I completely <laughs> concur. I am excited to meet the contestants as well, I understand. Of course you are, Nathan. Of course you are, yes. I know where you're coming from. <laughs> but yes, I'm excited. I'd like to pass on my knowledge, what I've learned at the finals in Mumbai. So yeah, I do want to help them. So what was that like in Mumbai? It was amazing. It was an amazing experience, but very stressful at the same time. Like the rehearsals were back to back. So we were getting up really early and me, like who likes to go to the gym. So I'd get up extra early to get to the gym and then get to rehearsals on time. So yeah. That's some commitment. It needed to be done. <laughs> I, I follow, I follow Nandini online and you know, you're, you're quite the, like I said, you, you're a gym freak now, aren't you? Yes. You're a gym freak. Well, no, a gym junkie. <laughs> Okay, so th there's, there's a lot more to it and, you know, some of the things we've been talking about today is winners of, of, of Miss India UK being role models and, you know, I've always thought, you know, we, we've got something, especially within sort of Indian backgrounds and stuff, you know, nutritionally speaking, yeah, which I know you're into right now, being a role model, educating people about how to just eat right and be better, healthier, really. Yes. For me, I think it's like it's changed my lifestyle, definitely. It's a passion of mine. So I like to share that with others. So I do put it up online, like my new recipes and everything. So yeah, Diwali just went. So, you know, we made some like healthier versions of Mitai. So. <laughs> you might have to share some of that with me. I like that. Yeah, I will do. Okay. Not now, though. <laughs> Not now. Okay, well, it's good, it's good to hear from you guys. Like I said, I'm sure we'll be catching up with you next time we're at one of the Miss India UK events. Enjoy the rest of your queen time. Thank you. Thank you. You enjoy the rest of your evening. <laughs>